Hmm? Oh, sorry. I didn't see you were here already. I'm, uh, hi. Mm-hmm. I'm your, uh, I guess, roommate for the rest of the semester. But, uh, hi. Mm-hmm. I'm one of the, uh, the, one the wizard guys. Mm-hmm. So, uh, what kind of, uh, classes are you going for here? Because I'm going for my culinary uh, masters. And baking. Oh, well, I'm not really good at baking. I tried it before, and it just didn't really work out for me. And, um, well, with everything in hand, I have a friend back home, and I want to see very, very badly. You could say I'm homesick, yeah. Just a little bit. But I'm getting used to being on my own and stuff. Mm-hmm. But with everything, I have, uh, I want to say four or five mi different classes throughout this semester that I have to get to. But that's not only until, like, uh, I think around maybe in three days? I can't remember. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, there's quite a lot of things I have to learn about first before getting into culinary. And, um, well, I thought this school would be pretty good for me. You know, I mean, it's a culinary school, so, I mean, why wouldn't it be good for me? Mm-hmm. Hmm? What's that? Hey. That looks sort of like my friend's bracelet. Mm-hmm. She kind of had one like that. It, it looks similar, but it looks different in a way. Do you know my friend? Her name is B. Oh, all right. Well, in that case, then I'll just leave that conversation to an end, then. My friend? Oh, B. Yeah, she's pretty cool. She talks a lot, though. She's pretty loud at times, but I like being her friend. And also, she has a weird cat. Was it a cat? I think it's a dog. It has a weird dog smell to it, but it looks more like a cat. I think she called it like puppy cat or something, so it's really confusing. Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry, I, I didn't get your name. Ah, it's nice, it's nice to meet you properly. Since I know your name now. Mm hmm Well, w what else would I come to culinary school for? I want to become a chef. I want to make meals for a lot of people. Make less people hungry and whatnot. Yeah. And also, I want to save enough money to fly back to my friend B's place. Because I like hanging out with her a lot. And, well, you could say I miss her. A lot. Mm-hmm. Although, I did have quite a weird dream about my friend. Whose name is B. Yeah, for some reason in this dream, me and her kind of disappeared into this space of some sort. Like it was all black and it went, 
like it took us down and we were floating and I saw blue stars and everything was so bright and then we met this uh giant T V head thing and it tried to it tried to burn me but luckily B told it to stop. Mm hmm. That's not even the crazy part about it. And then afterwards, we flew into the TV's mouth, and we got spit out somewhere else. And there was cooks everywhere. Well, I shouldn't say everywhere. There was only, like, two people there. One really big person and one small person. The small person had to go to the bathroom really bad, so we took over for him a little bit. Because the big person takes is making pastries. And, um, well, what else happened? It was all a blur, somewhat. It was kind of freaky at times, because I do remember my friend B saving me from, like, a crystal falling on my head, but then her arm was all messed up, and it looked like wires, kind of, like, robotic in a s way. And then she picked me up by my shirt, which I really thought she couldn't do, because she didn't look that strong, but I guess I underestimated her. She threw me up... And I swooped back down into my bathroom. And I thought it was all a weird dream. Which it was. And I didn't believe it was a dream at first. Because it seemed so real. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, um, I do have a sibling. I have a sister, which is kind of like my best friend in a way, but she tends to mess around with me a lot. Mm hmm. Yeah. No, no, well, yeah, it's. It's It was good meeting you as well, for you meeting me, and I also like meeting you as well. Mm-hmm. Of course. <laughs> yeah, I think we have a few classes together. I'm not sure, though. Um, do you mind if I take a look at your schedule? Cool. All right. Let's see. Hmm. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. No. Uh-uh. Uh, nope. Oh, right here. We have a, uh, a baking class together. That's weird. I thought I didn't sign up for any type of baking classes. Maybe it's part of the curriculum or something. Well, besides, like, cooking, I guess you have to have some sort of knowledge with around any type of b baking and whatnot. So, I guess I'll see you there at that baking class that we both have. Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought you were my roommate. I thought I was going to have a roommate. Oh, everyone has their own separate dorms. I see. Okay. Well, that makes things a lot more easier for me to live alone, I guess. Get used to it. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Hmm? Oh, <laughs> yeah. I kind of got burping out loud for my uh, sister. Yeah, when she drinks carbonated drinks and whatnot, she gets burpy. Mm hmm. Yeah, alright. Well, again, it was nice talking and meeting you for the first time. I hope we have a good friendship and whatnot coming these coming years. Uh huh. 
All right. Well, I'll see you at the baking class. Bye. What a nice person.